Okay, so I did a video um, about my son, how I taught my son, my six-year-old son, how to tie his shoes. Um, and that went over so well that I, that I wanted, or people, I guess, wanted me to shoot it again because we were using a black shoe with a black shoelace and that made it hard to see. So I'm going to show you guys again the easiest way to teach your kids how to tie their shoes. Now, I am a mom of eight and I had to teach kid number five how to tie his shoes really quick because he's never really had, um, shoes with laces before and then I got him a new pair of shoes with laces and um, he needed to learn how to tie his shoes with laces. Um, even though we kind of worked on tying it wasn't really a necessity because he didn't need it until all of a sudden he had these shoes and there's nothing worse you know we need our six-year-olds to be able to get their own shoes on to get out the door. We can't be sitting there and tying shoes. I have eight kids I need my kids to be able to help themselves um, help us all get out the door. So I'm going to show you this really super easy way how to teach your kids because, um, you know, you can teach them different methods. You know, prior to this, I guess I had taught my kids with the, you know, you can use the two bunny ear thing and then you can do like the rabbit hole, you know, like you got to go around and through the hole and all that stuff. And some of my kids are a little short on patience. And this little boy who needed to learn to tie his shoes this time around is one of those who is really short on patience. So let me show you this easy way, um, and this worked like a charm for him. No tears, and we had it, he had it down within two tries. So this is how this one works. So the first thing, and, and the reason it works is because they're doing the same thing both times, and they're so easy. Um, okay, so they start off by tying their shoe just like we all do, right? Just this, sit still please. Sorry, I have a six-year-old holding the camera. <laughs> so um, this normal thing they do, every time, right? Everybody starts off by tying their shoe that way. But now the beauty of this is they're going to basically do the same thing again. And that's why it's so easy. So here we are doing the same thing a second time, but instead of pulling it all the way through, um, I told him to stop when it looked about like a quarter, which is about like that. So then you have your quarter size hole and they're really, what they're doing is they're making the bunny ears themselves. Okay. So they can start with whatever side they want and it goes through the middle and they pull it almost all the way through, right? You can see the bunny ear. Then they take the other one and it goes through the middle too. And there we go. We can see both bunny ears, right? So then all they have to do is pull it. That is all there is to it, okay? So now that I've shown you, I'm gonna have my son show you. Um, and this again is literally like we worked on it and then we didn't. So this is probably his fifth time tying a shoe. So he's gonna show you how to do this. And it's so easy. I'm sorry. Okay, so now, there we go, through the center. There we go. Pull it almost all the way through. Yep, there you go. Now the next one has to go through the center. Pull it almost all the way through. Now, can you see your bunny ears? Where are your bunny ears? Pull the bunny ears. Look at that. How easy is that? Totally cool, right? All right, he's ready to go. So good luck, but this is how to teach your kids to tie their shoes with no tears. All right, see you later.